Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Leon, and today we're playing some more Team Fortress 2. We're playing Spy on PLR Hightower, actually my favorite map to play Spy on, I think you guys already know that. And right here in the beginning, I stabbed the sentry, killed this, killed this guy, and I followed my buddy West Coast host all across the map just to backstab him. But uh, today I'm going to be talking about some new games coming out uh, this year, uh, what I'm going to be playing, what I'm going to be uploading, and what I'm really, really excited about. So, uh, I, I talked about some of this before, but I'm going to go a little bit more in depth. So, uh, as some of you guys know, if you're my oldest subscriber, I've, I've, I've said this many, many times before, I'm a huge, huge Counter-Strike fan. And I've been playing Counter-Strike since one point, uh, CS 1.6 beta in 1.5. So, I was about 7 years old, 8 years old when I started playing Counter-Strike. And that was my first PC game. Uh, along with like GTA 3 and uh, so on and so on. So, uh, Counter Strike Global Offensive is coming out uh, early 2012. And from the footage I've seen, I'm really, really excited. But, you know, but it does not feel like Counter Strike. It doesn't, have, it doesn't really look and feel like Counter Strike 1.6. Counter Strike, even Source, even though Source wasn't even that good. It just, it just doesn't look and feel like the, the regular good old Counter Strike. But we'll see how, how it actually plays uh, when, when, you know, trying it out and trying to play it, you know, myself. But from, from, the, put from the footage I've seen and from uh, finding out that it's going to be released for console and it's going to be cross-platform, uh, it's not really making me happy. It's not really helping me out. So, uh, you know, if, if there is a way to play not cross-platform, because if we play cross-platform, this is what's going to happen. The console players are going to blame us for cheating. Uh, we are going to you know, shit on console players saying that they suck. And, uh, you know, for me, it's gonna be easy because for making videos, I'm just gonna rape a whole bunch of console boys and, uh, uh, get a gameplay of me going 30 and 2 in Counter Strike. But that's not what I want. I want some more competitive, uh, good gaming, competitive Counter Strike, especially. That was my, my, that was my core game back in the day. That was my core game for playing competitive. Before I started YouTube, before I did anything, even my first YouTube channel was, um, you know, dedicated to Counter-Strike. So if you guys are, you know, excited for that game, please write in the comments if you are. Uh, I'm really excited to make some videos for you guys. Now, and, I'm, and I'm, you know, I'm interested in uh, hearing your opinions on, on the Counter-Strike uh, Global Offensive. What you think it is, what you think, how you think it's going to be, and if you're going to play it or not. More games. Dota 2 and uh, Diablo 3. Diablo 3, I, I lost so much time, so much life uh, for Diablo, and um, like for Diablo and Diablo 2, those games are just incredible. I love both of those games with a passion. Uh, some of my favorite, uh, Diablo is one of my favorite franchises of all times, and uh, I might not look like it, and I, I've said this before, and hold on, I gotta fart. Okay, I don't know if they might pick that up, but um... <laughs> um Diablo 3 used to be my favorite franchise of all. Uh, kind of, you could say that. Not Diablo 3, just Diablo period. Diablo and Warcraft, like Warcraft Frozen Throne, Warcraft 3, uh, used to be my favorite games. So Diablo 3 and Dota 2 are going to be amazing. Uh, the footage I've seen of Dota 2 is just incredible. League of Legends uh, came from Dota 2. And look how big League of Legends is now. I mean... It's such a popular game. Dota, uh, Dota used to be one of the best things that ever came out, and that's all used to, people used to play. It, um, I mean, people still played like Angel Arena and like all those custom maps and custom stuff for Warcraft Frozen Throne, but for the main part, people played Dota. And tournaments went, uh, you know, there there were tournaments from Dota, uh, just for Dota, you know, nothing else, and there were tournaments for uh, just regular playing you know, Warcraft, but a lot of, a lot more people, you know, uh, attended Dota tournaments, and I've, I've watched a whole bunch of Dota tournaments, I've been to one myself, not playing, just watching, um, actually my, uh, cousin used to play Dota, and I went to a tournament, like, it was just a little, uh, you know, um, cyber, cyber cafe, with about 30, 35 PCs, 
and uh, you, you know there's about 20 people there they attended a little tournament for I believe $200 or something like that and uh, my cousin actually got third place and he got I believe 50 bucks so that's not too bad he used to be a really good player I mean I'm pretty sure uh, he's like 28 29 now I'm pretty sure he's still gonna play Dota 2 when it comes out and I hell I, I know I am gonna play that game that game is gonna be amazing Another game that's coming out is Diablo 3, like I said before, uh, that game is going to be great. Um, looking forward to just single player and storyline, and looking forward to multiplayer as well. And, um, you know, pretty much pretty much all those RPG and strategy games, uh, I'm really, uh, you know, I'm liking them. I really like role playing games, and especially like Dota 2 and, and, uh, and Diablo. Um, so I want to hear you guys' opinion on those games as well, and uh, please let me know. If you guys are buying Di Dota 2 and Diablo 3, if you're buying Dota 2, you can probably, if there's going to be a friends list option in there or something like that, uh, you guys could feel free to play with me. I'm going to have open lobbies in Dota 2 because I'm going to be playing that game a lot and uh, I'm probably going to stop uploading Team Fortress 2 for a little while. No, never mind. That's not going to happen. That's never going to happen, guys. Team Fortress 2 is always going to be the game I I'll, I'll play all the time. I mean, TF2 is the game that I enjoy playing the most. TF2 is the game that never uh, stays the same. It always changes all the maps. It's it's never the same. I always have uh, different fun in different maps, different game types. And, um, you know, I'm going to be uploading a lot of different games this year, upcoming year. 2012 is going to be a great year for video games and my YouTube channel, hopefully. And, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little gameplay. Unfortunately, we lose because my team does not want to play the objective ever. They really don't want to play the objective and unfortunately my team loses over here but I hope you guys enjoy the video still please let me know what you guys are playing and what you guys are expecting me to play and I will see you guys later enjoy some more beatbox for me guys uh, a lot of people have been requesting me to put beatbox in, in front of the end of my video so here you guys go peace out